Hi, Kurt Sabin here, uh, Goggle Category Manager for uh, Snow and MX, and give you uh, some pro tips on uh, lens care and cleaning for your uh, snow goggle. In every snow goggle is going to come with a warranty card and a lens care card. In that lens care card is going to cover everything that we're going to talk about today to extend the life of the product that you're going to be using. Please read that. So here we're going to talk about uh, inner lens care uh, for your snow goggle. All snow goggles come with a dual lens currently and what that pertains to is an outer lens and an inner lens that are bonded or adhered together. What this does is give a thermal barrier between the two lenses. That way you have your elements on the outside of the goggle, which are very, very cold, and the heat from your body and the moisture, keeping those two separated, eliminating the chances for fog. So each of the goggles will come with a lens protector on the back. Please remove that before you use it. That's there to protect and elongate the anti-fog properties prior to you getting it on mountain use. So in the event of a crash, you're gonna to wanna to clear out the lens with a lot of the moisture and snow. So always keep your goggle facing upwards to make sure that any new snow or moisture ingress doesn't land on the back of the lens. So what you're gonna do initially first is just gently bang the goggle on your uh, hand to remove any moisture on the back of the lens. If you don't remove that moisture, you're gonna get small crystal buildup. And when you go to clean the lens with your micro bag, you have a potential to scratch or damage the back anti-fog property. So gently blot the back of the lens with the micro bag, removing all of that moisture. You wanna make sure that you don't rub it like I mentioned a second ago. So after you've removed that moisture off the back of the lens, you're gonna to wanna to let the goggle dissipate, let the air and the moisture clear out. Two things you can do indoors, set it on the table and allow it to sit to air out, or if you're stuck outside, hold the goggle with the face up to make sure that no additional moisture hits the back of the lens. So once your lens is fully cleared of all your moisture, when you go to put this back onto your head or helmet, you're gonna make sure that your helmet is completely clear of any snow pack or any moisture. You don't wanna put this, the goggle onto your head after you've cleaned it with all of that moisture and again, build that product up with moisture and, and promote fogging. So this scenario, anytime you're headed inside to take a break, you're gonna wanna make sure you do not put that goggle on your head when you take it off. Not on your helmet, it might be snow pack or it might be some moisture. So you're gonna wanna take the goggle off, put it on the table, allow the air and the moisture to dissipate. So as you place the goggle down, and if you notice any type of moisture or snow pack on the goggle, you're definitely gonna to wanna to take a micro bag, block the lens to clear out that moisture, gently remove any type of snow pack, and then allow the goggle to place on the uh, table and air dry. So as you're finished with your break and you're headed out on mountain, you're gonna definitely wanna put the goggle on before you go outside. You wanna make sure you avoid any additional moisture getting to the back of the lens, compromising your anti-fog performance. So if you're finished for the day or, or for the trip and you're done skiing and you've uh, dried your goggle out, typically you're gonna store the product in the micro bag completely. One small little tip is gonna be leaving the strap outside the goggle bag. That will extend the life of the product and not damage the anti-fog of the lens. So at the end of the trip, we have two cases for storing your goggle in. We have a multi-case for multiple goggles, or we have a single case. Store your goggle in the micro bag and place it in the individual case. So in storing your goggle, what you don't wanna do is you don't wanna store it in your vehicle, on your dashboard, or outside overnight. The cold and the UV can damage your goggle. So just like any other product, uh, your goggle has a lifespan. If your goggle's over five years old, generally you're gonna re wanna replace that lens as the anti-fog properties are compromised and probably will not perform as you need. So an additional pro tip would be micro bag. Wash and clean this just like a pair of socks. Throw that into the washer with your laundry, good as new. And those are some of the pro tips for taking care of your goggle and extending the life of the performance.